Hey yo, Kirby Mercury here. Welcome back to Chasm. On the last episode, we got the feather that we needed so dearly, and I saved somewhere in the catacombs. However, I'm pretty sure I saved over here in this section, but I wanted to explore around to see where, if I could find the feather thing. And I totally found it. I'm pretty sure it's right below me. I feel bad because now I don't remember exactly where it was, even though it was not that long ago at all. No, it's not here. But yeah, let's go up here for a second. Actually, just to double check, I think it's right here. Gee. Oh, okay. I know where it is. It's, it is right where the path leads to in the middle of the screen but yeah let's go up here really fast because we couldn't come up here before we didn't have the wall jump so let's want to turn down the game a bit because it's blaring for me okay it's just one single thing gold crown sounds fancy Hack actually goes up. Oh wait, no, that's magic. So basically, everything magic, magic goes up by a bit. But we're not running magic right now. We are going to find ourselves a place to put our black feather. That is not an innu innuendo. Oh jeez. Yeah, luckily these guys don't really hurt us. However, that's not an excuse to take damage from them. Okay. Uh, yes, it's up here. Okay, I guess... Wall jumps. Or whatever we want them to be. I am very curious to see- oh well I guess I'm going to say curious to see what's going to happen when we do this, but I'm assuming that gate's going to open. We might have to fight a boss. Okay. Kind of anticlimactic. Okay. It is a dark area. Whoa! Super Meat Boy style. Bastard. I have to- oh you bastard. Okay, I guess that way works too. I was trying to get above it. Probably supposed to grapple onto those holds. Oh my god, I did not mean to fall. Why would I mean to fall, I guess? But anyways, we made it up. <laughs> Only got hit by the spikes 10 million times. Okay. New area, new enemies. How come... Okay, yeah, that works. I mean, I guess I only have to hit when it's necessary. Okay. What do we got? A stink man? Oh! Can I? I can break his stink clouds. Weird. Token. Pretty much useless. And I see someone. Oh, he's a friggin' straight out of a sh shmup. I never know how to pronounce that word. Shoot him up, game. Let's go. Let's just take a peek over here. Okay. I think I did that. I don't know why. Ooh, max MP. I don't know why I always try hitting the chest. <sighs> I'm just saying. 
Sometimes the controls in this game. I mean, nothing bad happened from me. Wall jumping weird, but it's just. It's just. Not good. Okay. Ugh. I know I could be. Ugh. What? Oh, okay. I didn't know it was hitting me. There's a friggin' hand coming out of the ground. Okay. We are taking some damage. Oh! Oh, I'm poisoned. Oh, it turns out poison lasts a very long time. Should have maybe invested in some antidote. Okay, arms coming on the ground. Bullet hell shooter man. Poison. Oh, freaking arm. But yeah, that arm is straight out of Castlevania. Oh. oh, we're gonna die. Please, I hate this fucking quick stand mechanic. Okay. Relax before things get very dire. Let's take a steak. I don't know how much a steak healed me. It didn't seem like anything, but it did. Maybe. Okay, we're not missing any paths. Okay, do not fall in the fucking slop. What is this? Press and hold back dash while falling. I don't know how to back dash. Okay. That's good. That's good. At least we can get our white chest now if we don't die in a couple of minutes. Worth it. I'm gonna forget about how to do this every time. Just trying to get used to it. Use our freaking Skyward Sword glider. Okay, it doesn't seem like I'm missing anything. But yeah, now I do have to figure out where the hell to go. the hell? I pressed the glider that time and it did not work. That's okay. Son of a bitch. Kind of close to the left. Get back here. You stupid hand. I mean, I shouldn't risk taking any damage, but... As long as I can get back to a save point, I should be fine. Oh, you bitch! Okay, luckily they don't hurt me for that for that much. I mean, it hurt me more to walk into. Mmm, you're f in garbage, man. Oh, the hands of death. Okay, we want to look at the map. We have a little ways to go. I mean, I think I have every... Metroidvania-like pickup in the game so far. I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. Coffee boy. Oh, 
I fucking seen the hand that time, and I did nothing to avoid it. In fact, I walked right into it. That ruby. Ooh. Ugh. You jerk. Give me life. Please, Black Feather, save me. Just have to make it to the save room. And luckily, these guys can only hurt us for one. So I'm not that afraid, but you never know. I could fall into a pit of sludge. It's happened quite frequently. And or those guys could be stronger than I think they are. By the time I beat this game, it'll be, be the time I actually get somewhat used to the controls. Still feels like very stiff to me. And yeah, like I said, I, I was playing uh, Castlevania 4 and that game felt like a lot better to control than this. Anyways. Um, just double check I saved, even though I'm sure I did. Okay. Oh yeah, we have not got the ability to dig through the ground yet. Not like that's super important. But I would like to figure out where to go next. There is that there's a couple sections in the garden where I didn't even really check. I keep Probably our next logical area to go to. I mean, I could do all the stuff in the mines I haven't done yet. But I should probably just go to the keep. And continue going right. But yeah, in the next episode, either I'll be in the keep... Or we'll get there together, but I'll probably just travel there before I start the episode. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more in the future, and have a lovely evening. Good night.